Well, the number of pensioners increased from 43,208 in December 2021 to 44,640 the following year, with the average monthly payment for 2022 at $25.2 million compared to $23.5 million a year prior. Minister with Responsibility for the National Insurance Board, the Honorable Miles LaRota, using the unsustainable figures to strengthen his pitch to increase national insurance contributions. For the year ended December 2022, contributions totaled around 280 million, while benefits expenditures totaled 355 million, a shortfall of some 78 million. The NIB budget for 2023 has projected that benefits will exceed contributions by $86 million and projects total income to be $358 million, with total expenditures of $456 million, resulting in a deficit of $98 million. Alarota says the goal is to collect some $300 million in contribution payments. In the meantime, it's sought to make compliance easier. We have recruited in January of 2023 some 20 new inspectors, roughly between New Providence and the Family Islands. Given the increased economic and rebuilding activity occurring in New Providence and the various Family Islands, this improved coverage should be a solid support base in improving employer compliance across the entire Bahamas.